can you even see? And he's like, oh no, no, this has to go in the butt. He's looking at me like, drop them draws, babe. <laughs> Good morning, you guys. <laughs> I feel like I never vlog like this, but <sighs> the day is starting early, okay? It is currently 7.50 something. And I'm on my way to the urgent care um, because I have a rash all over my body, like all over my stomach, like TMI, but like all over my butt, and it's so itchy. I've had it for a few days. I showed my mom, and she said it looks like chicken pox. And at first I was like, no, stop, girl. But it do be kind of looking like chicken pox, though, and I'm scared. So we're gonna go to the urgent care right now. They open at eight, it's seven, like 55. I live really close, so I'll get there by eight, and hopefully, they can help me out or something, you know? They can tell me what's going on, babe. So yeah, I'm up this morning. It's literally about to start storming outside. Like, the weather's so bad right now. And on top of that, you guys, the worst part is I woke up this morning, got ready, brushed my teeth. I'm like going through my bag and I look up on my wall and I see a huge spider. And when I say huge, I mean huge. Like the ones you see on like Instagram and stuff of people trying to kill them and it's like super dramatic. Those. And I'm like, oh, what? I'm, so I'm sorry. I have like this spider spray that I was going to try and use to kill it. But when I looked up, it was gone. I literally looked away for like less than a minute. And when I looked up, it was gone. Backup camera saves my life every time because I don't know how to park. So... Um, but yeah, I'm the first one here it looks like which is great. I hope they're open because it's also it's Sunday And it's also Father's Day today apparently <laughs> Apparently, so I don't know if they're open online. It said they would be so I'm praying that they do or else I just got up this early for no reason you guys I literally didn't go to bed until like 2 45 a.m So the fact that I even got up this morning at 7 30 just shows my pure dedication to figure out what the hell is going on with my body I've had the rash since it first appeared, like the bumps on my body first appeared last Tuesday, kind of started coming in, but like the full blown like rash rash, like it didn't start like getting really like swollen, red and itchy until like maybe Wednesday. I really don't know y'all, okay, it's been a couple days, but I know that chicken pox, online it says that chicken pox is supposed to like blister and like fill with something I guess, and then blister and then like turn into this whole thing. Mine's not doing that and I've already had it for a couple days, so. But I do also know that when you have been vaccinated, it's not as worse, and I'm assuming I have been, y'all, but I'm scared they're gonna tell me that I have like monkey pox or something. <laughs> I don't know I'm really scared and like I also have insurance and I'd be acting like I don't like I'd be never wanting to go to the, to the doctor or anything like that and I'm like girl you got insurance you better use it I wish I could show you my rash <laughs> not that you ask not that you want to see but I feel like I should right can you even see you can't really see but it's there I feel like they're gonna be like girl if you don't take your ass home no 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 i need you guys to tell me what's going on i made this decision to come last night because last night i ended up getting off of work from a 13 hour shift and i was so itchy probably from wearing all those disgusting clothes for 13 hours straight and i was so itchy i scratched everywhere and i know that i wasn't supposed to be doing that but it was just felt so good and once i started i couldn't stop and I just scratched everywhere and then everything was swollen and it looked so bad when it was all swollen like that. And I was like, oh my God, this is really bad. Like I need to go to the emergency room. But now that everything's not irritated, everything looks normal. And I feel like they're gonna tell me, like I almost feel like I need a scratch before I go in there. Anyway, it's eight o'clock on the dot. So let me go in there because I'm trying to be the first person so I can dip. You know? So we're gonna go in here and I'll try and film, but honestly, probably not. We'll see, we'll see. I wish I had my mom. <laughs> Goodness. And then there's people in here that are like literally like coughing their lives away. And I'm like, I meant to bring a mask with me. I just, it's so early in the morning, I forgot. But <sighs> let's see what they say. I got in pretty quickly, so that's good. Always go early, guys. Let's see what they say. Okay, update. So the doctor came in. 
she said it doesn't look like chicken pox. She said it literally just looks like hives, like an allergic reaction. Thank God. I do have to get a shot though. I have to get a shot and I have to take some pills and then she's gonna prescribe me some other like steroids. Not excited about the steroids, but anything to get this to go away. I'm gonna get a shot, which I'm not excited about. I haven't had a shot in like two years. It's that bad. Either way, it's fine. I just got the shot and that shit hurts. It hurts. The actual shot itself, like him putting the needle in, didn't hurt. But he was like, yeah, the liquid's gonna burn. And I was like, oh, okay, cool, 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 cool. No, the liquid burns. It burns actively to this very moment. I'm like sitting <sighs> on an angle because it hurts. I have to get in my butt, by the way. And it was a nail doctor, let's not even talk about that, but I'm literally clenching. I'm clenching every cheek. They also gave me some Benadryl, so I'm probably gonna knock out when I get home. <laughs> I'm afraid to sit properly, you guys. This thing stings so bad. Yeah. Okay. Okay, well, I don't have chicken pox, so that's good. She said it looks like hives. It's mainly in one area. I have little bits here and there. She said it looks like hives, so that's good. No chicken pox. That's great. And she gave me two Benadryl, and then I had to get a shot in my butt of some medicine that I don't know how to pronounce. That really hurt. When he first put the needle in, it was a man, by the way. She's like, yeah, I'm gonna give you a shot. And I was like, oh, okay, go, 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 go. And then he comes in, the guy, the nurse, or whatever, and he comes back in, he's like, yeah, I've got some stuff for you. And I was like, okay, go, 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 go. He's gonna give me a shot. So I take off my jacket, and he's like, oh, no, no. This has to go in the butt. So I take the Benadryl, I sit there for a second, and he's looking at me like, drop them draws, babe. <laughs> And so I get up and I turn around and I'm like, this is awkward. So then he gives me a shot. He's like, you're gonna feel a little bit of a pinch. I was like, I don't feel anything. The actual needle, I felt nothing. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. I don't feel anything. And he was like, lots of practice. I'm like, dude, you're creeping me out. Stop right now. But then he's like, you're gonna feel the liquid burning though. Like it burns. And I was like, oh, okay. First couple seconds, I'm waiting. Nothing. I'm like, oh, okay, cool. I'm just, I'm just real tough. You know, then he pulls the needle out and he's like, all right, you're all set. She just wants you to sit. For, she'll probably want you to sit for like 10 minutes or so, but you know, you're all good. I was like, okay, cool. I go to sit down and it kicks in. It kicks in hard. And my, it like, it's like all down my leg. Like I literally could feel it like burning and going through my body. Like it just, they said if it doesn't get better in a couple days, just let me know. But she said it just really looks like hives, which is what I initially thought it was. But I don't know. I've never had hives last like a couple days like this. I don't know how I'm going to drive because I'm literally on one butt cheek right now. Publix Pharmacy doesn't open until 11 a.m. And that's the one that I had them sent to. So I'm going to just have to go and get some coffee and then. All right. So let's just go to Starbucks and get a coffee and we'll go from there. Y'all, I feel like I had the longest day yesterday. I got to work at 11.30 yesterday, and I didn't get home from work, or I didn't get out of work until 1.30 a.m. How does that end up happening? I don't know. Ugh, oh, I wanna go home and go to sleep, but I'm scared of the freaking spider. I just hope that it's tucked away. I don't wanna see it, okay? I don't wanna see it out of sight of the mind. I'm trying to like go back and take a nap, to be honest. So like, as long as I don't see it, I'm good. My chest is itchy when I do this. That feels good. I made it. And of course the line is long as all get ups. I would go inside, but I'm starting to feel sick a little bit. I'm a little bit nauseous and I'm a little bit sleepy. Oh my God. A freaking bug just landed on my window and I looked up and all I see is this huge bug in front of my face and I'm like, freak out, but it's on the outside. It's like that episode of SpongeBob when the butterfly lands like this close to his face and it's terrifying. That's what it looks like right now. Yeah, I'm starting to feel sick, a little bit nauseous and I'm starting to be get a little bit drowsy. My stomach is kind of turning and I kind of should have eaten something because now I feel terrible. I should have eaten something before I went, but it's fine. Oh, uh, I don't feel good. Yeah, I'll be back when it's time to order. Good morning. May I start for you? Good morning. Can I get a venti iced white mocha with vanilla sweet cream cold foam? Yes. Can I get a plain bagel toasted with cream cheese? It's already. And that'll be all. Car in front of me just left without their whole last coffee. Oh my God, I need a straw too, but I hate being that person that needs everything. 
But yeah, I just got my usual drink. It looks really good. It's a little bit dark this time, so like I'm kind of worried about that. But there's a car behind me, so I gotta go. Many hours later. I'm back. I think the last time we talked, it was like, what, like 9.45-ish? around there i had just come back from starbucks i think it's 1 110. i went home ate my bagel completely neglected my coffee because it honestly it wasn't as good as it usually is and i just didn't feel well enough to, i wasn't into it went to sleep woke up at about 12 and then sat in my bed for another hour on tiktok but it's finally time for me to go to the store i need to get my prescription I'm still drinking this coffee. I'm going to drink it, I don't care. I'm not wasting this coffee because it was like $8. We're not wasting her, we're going to drink her. And it honestly tastes better now than it did earlier. I think I just didn't feel well earlier. So I just was like, mm. I still kind of feel a little bit like, not great, but I feel okay enough to go to the store and walk around and get the things I need. We're gonna go get some groceries, get our prescription. I still have not found the spider either it wasn't there i have a feeling it's not going to come out till the sun goes down right now let's go ahead and head on to Publix because i need to get my prescription above everything so it's honestly still cold let's go to Publix. i'm still tired <laughs> but i made it i keep forgetting that today's father's day and it's also sunday which is like a popular grocery shopping day i feel like so there's actually quite a bit of people here let's go in here because i'm actually ready to get back in my bed no i can't get back in bed i have so much work to do Okay, you guys, I'm back in the car. AC is booming because it's 94 degrees out and it's so hot. Um, let me show you what I got. A little haul, if you will. I got these summer spring rolls. So good. It's like imitation crab and like shrimp with like veggies and stuff. And then it comes with like the sweet chili sauce. And then I got a Caesar salad that I don't feel like picking up because it's the bottom of this bag. And then I got these little snack pack like sandwiches that I always get. It comes with fruit on the side and then half a sandwich with this really yummy honey mustard mayo sauce. Sounds disgusting, that combination, but it's so good. My prescription that I got, <laughs> I got some milk. I got this, these uh, brown sugar cinnamon pastry kiss. These things are so good. To me, this literally tastes like a Pop-Tart. I got some deodorant because I'm running low. I got this Michelangelo's shrimp scampi like dinner, the frozen dinner. I love a good frozen dinner. I know that that's terrible. But like, I'm the type of person that if I want to eat, I want to eat now. And I don't want to have to wait 30 minutes to cook the food, so. And then I got my favorite chips right now. This is my current obsession. These Stacy's cinnamon sugar chips. And I think that's pretty much, oh, I got Benadryl. But that's, again, very deep down in there. But I think that that's pretty much it for this video. Anyway, you guys, I will keep you updated on my little rash journey. I love you guys. And I will see all of you in my next one. Bye. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> I know that I said I was done, but I got home and I have a package that I ordered and I completely forgot about. I didn't realize it was coming today. Mainly like phone cases and stuff, but there's some stuff for like ASMR in here. If you don't know, I have an ASMR channel linked in the description. But there's some stuff in here that I'm really excited about. So I don't fully remember what I got, but I, I'm just excited to receive anything. So I wanna open this with you really quickly before we go for real, for real. Okay, this is the bag I got. It's like one of those like puffy puffer bags that people always use like at the gym and stuff. Really cute, so I got one. I actually ordered two by accident, so I had to return one. This is the bag. I don't know why, I just think that this is so cute and like convenient. It's pretty spacious inside to like put quite a bit of stuff. Quality is pretty good too. The quality is actually better than I thought it was gonna be, which is nice. 
it's like a little tote bag and I think that this is really cute if I ever want to like go out in public and like take my um, computer and my iPad to do some editing or something like that let me see if, let me get my my computer see if it fits in here it's my computer yeah it'll fit perfectly in here it'll fit perfectly if it's perfectly literally perfectly my computer is the literal same size as my ipad so i'm sure my ipad will fit in here perfectly as well my goal is to start like going out in public and editing so i can get more work done because the one time i did that i actually got a lot of work done for like two hours so going to like a coffee shop or like barnes and noble and just sitting down and enjoying my time uh oh i got this little sweater thingy my bob in my favorite color it's one of those like quarter zip jackets. It is a little bit small because I definitely think that I got it in an extra large and it does seem a little bit short, but it's not gonna be as big as I want it to be, but it still be, will be pretty big. I would try it on, but I simply don't have the energy to get up off the floor. It's a little bit thin, but I also get really hot and I sweat very easily, so I don't mind that it's kind of thin. <gasps> this is one of the phone cases. I'm gonna save the phone cases for last because I got a lot. I got like six of them. And then I got these press-on nails. Came with like these really cool charms, like these really cool like 3D charms that I'm really excited about. So I'm like, Oh, and then I also got these little metallic stickers for nails again. I've been seeing people with these little like metallic-y looking things on their nails all the time. And I was like, I want to try it, but I don't have the patience to just sit there and draw that on my fingers. So I seen the stickers and I was like, ooh, let me get them out and see what they look like. So maybe I'll do that on my next nail journey video. Now for the most exciting part, the phone cases. I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I got six phone cases. Anyway, the first one, oh my, how cute is that? And it's shaped like this, and it's actually pretty thick quality too. It's not like terrible, terrible quality at all. I'm like, that's so cute. And then it comes with this little like pop socket-y thing. Now, don't get me wrong, you guys. This is from Shein, obviously. So I don't know how long this thing particularly is gonna last, if it might fall off or not. But I mean, it was also, these phone cases were all like $3. So I feel like, when they break, I'm not all that pressed about it because it was $5 and I'm well aware of that. Ooh, okay, the next one's cute. But it's like a gradient blue glitter with butterflies and then it says like butterfly in cursive. And then again, it has like this little like ridgy thing on the side. This one would be so cute on my phone. Like look at how cute that is. Ooh, and this one came with a little, <gasps> oh my gosh. This one came with a little like, the little like what is it called i don't know what it's called you put it on your phone so it can be like around your little wrist like a little holder band thingy i don't know what it's called but that is gorgeous oh my god i love this one this is my favorite so far okay let's do another one with a little band like a wristband i don't know what it's called but ooh, this one's cute oh my goodness how cute is this uh look at her are you kidding me this one's Gorge. I don't love this purple color. It's kind of deep. It's a really deep purple. I don't love that, but I love this. The, I got this because this kind of reminds me of like, I believe it's called Cause. He's like a designer. Is he a designer or is he like a artist? I think he's an artist and he makes like really cool like sculptures and art pieces and stuff. And this reminded me of like his work and I can't afford his work, so. We got this, but it's really cute. And it comes with, again, a little holder thing, which is really convenient. And you can actually take it off and then clip it, which is really cool. But it also gives me BTS vibes. So if you know, you know. All right, let's move on to the fourth one. I don't even remember which ones I got, but I'm happy with everything so far. Ooh, okay, this one's pretty basic. This one's pretty basic, but it's actually cool still. So it's, again, another one of these. It's a clear one. And it's another one of these ones that have like the ridges in it and then it's like a little heart but then it also comes with this little like crystal heart pop socket thing crystal heart pop socket thing it's like an actual like pop socket that you stick on there and it's like crystal looking that's actually really cute Ooh, okay Ooh, this one does not look like what i thought it was going to look like but it's still cute so it's like a clear clear case but it's like kind of like a clear blue up here and then it like fades into clear and then again, you get like a pop socket that goes on the back, like a blue, like, I don't know, like bubble 
looking pop socket kind of matches the thing on my nails kind of matches the thing on my nails to be honest but i was actually the most excited about this one but it doesn't look like what i thought it was going to look like the last one that i got <gasps> very cute is this one i want you guys to see like all the glitters and stuff it's like co covered in like glitter ah, this is so cute this is giving me like Z, Z phone vibes from like Hannah Montana if you know you know. I really like this one actually it's really cute. Really cute in person I feel like it might look a little bit plain on camera but the shininess of like all the little like crystal looking things really giving her some pop. I absolutely love this one. This one's for sure my favorite. It's so cute. It's very like cushiony and thick too. I also wonder, I don't know how you're supposed to like put this on the phone i have to figure that out how this goes on the phone i don't know how that works but very cute i love this one this one's probably my favorite okay guys i'm actually gonna go this time it just got so dark in here because it's literally about to start pouring down raining so dark like almost like nighttime dark it's kind of scary so i'm actually gonna go this time i'm gonna go take a shower do some work take my meds <laughs> And just enjoy the rest of my day. Uh, thank you guys so much for being here. I love all of you. And I'll see you in my next one. Bye.